Okay, as I previously shown, I have these LED rings um, outputting the different parameters, the acceleration, speed, and theoretical distance. Now, there's not any um, feedback from the servo. This is just the commands being sent to the servo. And so now, as I mentioned, the acceleration is ramps up. Now the rate of change of, in acceleration is called the jerk. And we can actually change the output here. So it outputs the jerk parameter. Now the jerk is, when, it, when it's changing the acceleration, the amount of change is constant. So it's a constant jerk um, to, to produce the change of acceleration. And so I'll let you watch a couple cycles of the jerk, acceleration, and speed parameters. Now, I'll switch back to, I think this is the one, nope. Okay, this is the one I'm after. Now I showed you how I combined the acceleration, speed, and distance all into one reading in this one, and how it does not is not an intuitive gauge, at least to me. The green and red combined to make yellow um, to look like yellow is not intuitive that it's green and red, and so it's not. I don't think that's a very useful gauge, but I think you can combine some gauges, and I what I'll do is combine. Um, Okay, that's the jerk. We'll combine jerk and acceleration. So jerk is in blue on the far left, and acceleration is in red again. And you can see when the jerk is applied how the acceleration changes. We'll just watch a couple cycles of this. Negative jerk, reduce the acceleration. Negative jerk again to slow down the, the speed. And then we go to positive jerk or positive acceleration. Then we're going to slow it back down. And of course, the servo comes to a stop before we are finished decelerating it. That's just because the servo, I don't have feedback, and so very slow speed commands are not executed on the servo. Okay, so that's with the, the jerk and acceleration combined. And I think that's pretty much what I wanted to show you in this video. I will just watch it, let it go through a couple more cycles. Okay, and that's it for now, once we get to the final distance. There we go.